Hi guys, this is Yash from Unleash the Phones and I have here with me the Nokia Asha 311. Now in this video I'm going to show you how you can update your Asha device over the air without having to use a laptop. This works for all the Asha, device, Asha Touch devices like the Nokia Asha 305, 306 or 3089 as well as the 311. What we'll do is we will uh, unlock the phone first and suppose if you're on any other home screen you can just swipe across to the menu grid and from the menu grid we will open the settings in settings just scroll down and uh, go to the phone sub menu over here there's an option for device updates now uh, over here you can check what the current software details on your phone is and uh, as well as we can connect to Nokia server to see if there's an update available and download it I'll just click on download phone software uh, this is normal prompt to warn you about network charges now I don't have any sim card in this phone right now so I'm going to use my uh, home Wi-Fi network but in case you had a sim card then and you don't have access to a Wi-Fi network you can just click back and you would be prompted whether you want to use a Wi-Fi or the phone data I'll again start the update process and I'll just connect to my Wi-Fi network hold on a second so I just entered my Wi-Fi password and it's connecting to Nokia server now. It has connected and it seems to have found an update. There you go. Here's the update info. The update is there is an update available, the size is nearly 7 MB and approximate installation time is less than 20 minutes. I'll, you can either download the update now or you can choose back to download it later. We will start the download. And till the time it downloads, I'll just pause this video. And I'm just about to finish downloading the update. There you go, the update has been downloaded. Now uh, we'll click on more. Although uh, your data should not be deleted but it is always recommended to back up your data before updating the device. For now since I don't have any uh, data on the device I'll directly click on install. And uh, after preparing the update phone will restart and will update automatically. Since we have a 1 GHz processor on board, it should not take a lot of time. I think this is it. Your update has been downloaded, installed and the phone will now reboot. Software successfully installed. So there you go. You can... I'll just set the software updating to check every month. So as you can see, I downloaded, installed and finished with the update in less than 5 minutes. If you have any Asha devices around you or any of your relatives, please do check for updates and update the devices 
it's an easy process thank you for watching